Welcome to the Sebastian Show. We got lots of things for you today. Welcome to the Sebastian Show. Hello, and welcome to another episode of No Sense for Nonsense. Today, I will be talking about Twilight and the breaking porn. I mean, dawn. Yep, it is true. Another Twilight movie. Personally, I am not a Twilight fan. But why do these Twilight movies attract so many viewers? Is it because A, the movies are very good? Or is it because B, the actors are very hot and sexy? I mean, don't get me wrong, Kristen Stewart is super hot. Is that why you watch a certain video? Do you watch the video because you think the actor is hot and sexy? Do you think I am hot and sexy? Hey Tim, am I hot and sexy? Ever since you started the show, people have said that you look like a dog, a pirate and a yeti. How can you say that? It's not true! Now after watching the trailer for the new movie, something disturbing came to mind. Now first of all, in the trailer, you see Kristen Stewart, the human girl, and Robert Pattinson, Edward the Vampire, doing... doing the dooby-doo. The chimney chang. I'm talking about sex if you didn't realize. Now vampires are the living dead, so technically, they are dead. So when a human has sex with a vampire, the living dead, it is considered as necrophilia. And last I heard, that is a very bad thing to do. Hey Tim, tonight we're going to see Twilight and the Breaking Dawn. Oh god, really? What is it about? It's an exciting movie with love, romance, drama, and some pretty people having necrophilia sex. <laughs> now I know that the age restriction for the previous movies was PG-13. Now I wonder if the Twilight Breaking Dawn's age restriction will go up to 16 years old for example? Or maybe I'm just old fashioned. Let's just, for the sake of it, pretend that you're a fan of Twilight. Or you are actually a fan of Twilight. Would you go watch the movies if the actors looked anything like Quasimodo? Now here is an interesting story. My stepbrother is studying to become a psychologist, right? And one day he told me a story that there were these psychologists who were trying to do a certain test on something, but that's not important. What they had to do is they had to find a whole bunch of men, a group of men who have watched porn, have seen porn before, and another group of men with a whole bunch of guys who have never seen porn in their entire lives. But they were unable to do the test because they were unable to find one, not, they were unable to find even one guy who has never seen porn before. Now if you like watching the Twilight movies, go ahead, do what you feel like doing. If you like those movies, then good for you. Me, personally, I am a Harry Potter fan. I have seen all the movies. But I haven't read any of the books. Yes, I know, I am a traitor. Now before I go, I'd like to tell you one thing is that in my last video, I made a video explaining the fact that I was unhappy that YouTube does not feature random videos anymore on the homepage. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to select a random name from the comments down below to put on my outro of each video I make. So, that's all for today. So please don't forget to leave a nonsensical comment down below to tell me who would win in an epic battle. Blade or Edward the Vampire. And please don't forget to hit the subscribe button very hard with your head. And also don't forget to rate and favorite this video and even send it to all your friends, your family and even your dog. Until next time, keep it nonsensical. Hello, farewell, I'll and goodbye. I hope you enjoy the special.